Well, the Hunter Chases are back. Well, sadly, still isn't, so I'm going to give them a bash. For the first half of the season, at least, I've got a two and a half mile north to 100 Hunter from Lark Hill coming up. Don't expect me to know anything about these courses the way that Stu does. It's October, Bay at the top four. Graham Clutterbuck, Casherell, Martin Leedham, Andre the Giant, Matt Cooper, Titch Jazz, Alex Cherry, Madame May Lynn, or Padre Hogan, and forceful perform for Matt Cooper. So a field of six in this then. And away we go. The rain coming down at Lark Hill. And Titch Jazz will lead into the first and they all get over it okay 18 fences to take in this first hunter of the season and forceful performance come around the outside to now burst into the lead so forceful perform from titch jazz and then october bay closest to us is again the second cashier in the purple and white stripes matt cooper double handed has got andre the giant in this as well and Padraig Hogan's Madame May Lynn in the yellow jacket is just the back market past the winning post with goodness knows how many circuits to go probably two I would think and a force will perform I can't see it being a 17 furlong round course and I can't really see it being a four furlong round course either so really safe to say two ver two circuits to go and force will perform is the leader by about two lengths to Casherell in second and then Titch Jazz third, October Bay fourth, Madame Mary Lynn has now moved through into fifth, and the back marker is Andre the Giant. As they get into the next, Andre the Giant a little bit ponderous at the back. Not keen on jumping by the looks of things, but maybe we'll settle down as the race goes on. The forceful performance set in a strong pace actually, the stable companion of the back marker. And they're well strung out as they head down towards the next. Force will perform in front by three lengths. Oh, Casherella was slow. A big looking water jump, that one. And Titch Jazz has now moved up into second. October Bay is fourth. With Madame Mary Lynn after that one. I think it's Madame May Lynn. Mary Lynn. It's Force will perform. Stood off that one, we got a bit nicely. Casherell was a little bit slow. Titch Jazz and October Bay both jumping past that one. Then Madame Maylene and then Andre the Giant has attacked that giant ditch. And they're all over that one, okay. The fences come up thick and fast in these hunters. And Forceful Perform is in the lead. As they get over the next, yeah. Titch Jazz on the inside of the striped Casherell and October Bay. And Graham Clutterbuck, who I think designs all these point to point courses. You can see a good job he does as well. Andre the Giant is next, gone past Madame Maylin as they get over that 11th. And Casherell's come up on the inside of Force will perform now to see the first change of leadership. October Bay coming around the outside. And Titch Jazz. Close as well. These four are well clear of the other two, Madame Malin and Andre the Giant. There's still a good seven furlongs to go. Plenty of jumping to do, and Casherell nearly went there. Really bad mistake by Casherell. October Bay has gone on. Titch Jazz is in second. Then Forceful Performers drop back into fourth with Madame Malin trying to run on. Andre the Giant appearing to be out of it as they get over the next again. One or two of them a little bit slow and taking some time in the air, but October Bay is clearing the lead still by about two lengths to Casherell and Titch Jazz, who are fighting back as they get over that ditch. Titch Jazz jumping it well on the inside, and it's October Bay in front from Titch Jazz and Casherell. These three clear of Madame Maylin, who's getting a little bit closer. The Matt Cooper pair have dropped to the back. But it's October Bay, still in front with four to jump. This is the fourth last. Over it they go, and the field just beginning to bunch up again now. 
As October Bay continues to lead, Tits Jazz in second, Casherell hit a bit of a flat, flat spot in third, Madame Malin running on as they get over to third last, but she jumped that one slowly, Andre the Giant's gone past force for reform, but they're swinging into home now then, and it's October Bay on the outside in the lead from Casherell and Tits Jazz, these three clear still of Madame Malin and Andre the Giant over the second last, October Bay landed in front, Casherell's in second, Tits Jazz is in third, they head down to the final fence, over it they go, and it's October Bay who's over it clearing the lead and he's going to take it and Graham Clutterbuck is going to take the first hunter chase of the season jockey looking the wrong way over his shoulder but October Bay wins it, Casherell second, Tiss Jazz third Andre the Giant was fourth and then Madame May Lynn fifth of the long time leader dropped right out of it at the back but October Bay for Graham Clutterbuck takes the first hunter chase of the season from Casherell in second for Martin Leadham. Titch Jazz was third for Alex Cherry. Andre the Giant, Matt Cooper fourth. And Madame May Lynn for Padraig Hogan was fifth.